Hello Air Signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Welcome back to my channel everyone and thank you so much for being here with me. I really do appreciate you tuning into the channel of course. So um, this is going to be intended for Gemini, uh, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Aqua, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus or Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. And it's going to help you see what your person is truly thinking and feeling right now um, in this moment. So um, we'll lay out some cards for their true thoughts and we'll lay out some more cards for their true feelings. So uh, we'll see what comes up uh, in the cards here. So if you do enjoy this reading, please feel free to leave behind a like, share, subscribe. Um, feel free to sign up to the channel for membership to get access to certain readings. Um, and extended readings as well. Uh, otherwise, I really appreciate you being here. So let's lay out some cards here, air signs, and see what comes up. Uh, for the air signs, what is this person thinking and feeling? What are they thinking and feeling? Okay, let's look at their thoughts in the top row. Okay, so they've been thinking a lot about the future. And I can see that they've been talking and discussing future plans, either they're uh, thinking about discussing future plans with you, or um, I feel like they're thinking about telling someone here. So there's someone that they trust. Um, it could be someone that they work with. I'm getting a strong work energy. Mm. Because they have that Knight of Pentacles with the Three of Pentacles and the Ace. So I'm thinking... They, they keep thinking about having a conversation about you to someone that they know and they trust. And it's almost like they've got a lot on their mind that they need to sort of discuss. But I think it's concerning the future. Um... And they're excited. I feel like when they think about you, they get very excited because that King of Wands is here. Um, and I feel like it's the future because there's a lot of cards that look to the right. So that's indicating what's coming up, the long-term goals um, and the long-term vision uh, between you and them. So they are considering you um, and they're imagining what life would be like with you in their life long term. So if that means settling down, if that means like what you'd be like traveling with, what you'd be like starting a life with, what you'd be like having kids with, they keep thinking about all these big things, okay? It's not small things. So it's either this person is falling for you very fast that they're thinking about these things, or it's them you like you're sort of waking up these emotions like maybe they weren't really intending to get serious or they just wanted something light and fun but the more and more as time goes on they start to think about this more more and more seriously so there's an excitement but at times they also like they have unsettled thoughts so i do want to say sometimes they they do have thoughts in the back of their mind it might not be very big thoughts they might not stick around for very long, but the, with the King of Wands, it's like, is this more than just an attraction? Because maybe you've, you guys have a rocking sex life or you have a lot of chemistry um, because it's stability versus what they're thinking now is like stability versus the chemistry and the sexual connection you have. They probably haven't found anyone like you um, and like no one compares. So they're like, okay, I want something serious and this person is like, exactly what I want, like to the T, like physically. So you're ticking a lot of box, uh, a lot of boxes for them air signs. So that's why I feel like it might have, especially if it sort of started out with an attraction and started more innocent and more playfully, you're doing something to them that's making them want you much, much more seriously, especially they keep thinking about this. Um, but I can, I, I can see with the three of pentacles, they're talking to a lot of people about you and people are picking up on this. So don't be worried, you know, like if they have crushes or they have exes, it's like they keep mentioning you, you keep coming up. And if you keep coming up, it is reflecting that you, that they think about you a lot and people are starting to see that about them. 
in terms of how they're feeling wheel of fortune eight of one six of cups and the hermit card okay this person might have felt lonely for a long time with the hermit so especially if they were single um or they had like a bad really bad relationship you've sort of come into their life and made them feel really special once again i'm getting a sense that you've renewed their hope and love um, six of uh, six of cups is like that past energy so this is making me i'm getting a vibe that i feel like they might have come out from a, a previous relationship or they might be like comparing you to an ex but the feelings that you give them just can't compare um you know i don't know what you're doing here you know if you've been showing them a lot of love and you've been showering them with affection and you've been really caring about them, then they're feeling cared for. Why? Because the six of cups is children um, and children want to be loved. They want to be, you know, cuddled um, and adored and you're sort of showering them with that emotion and they're like, I can't believe this is what real love feels like because no one in the past has ever done, done this for me. Have I been missing out on this all this time? It's like you've come up and you've showed them, um, and you know communication appears to me very uh, appears to be very big so they're feeling eight of ones they're really feeling smitten with you so like i said it's that chemistry but i feel like with the six of cups there's someone who's starting to fall here especially if you're still in the early stages of a connection um, and I feel like with the Wheel of Fortune, they feel like you have come together at such a pivotal point in each other's lives. Um, you know, like maybe you had plans to live overseas or you had plans to study or you had plans to go back to someone else. Um, or maybe they had plans to do this with the Wheel of Fortune, but then fate sort of has stepped in. At least this is how they feel, that fate sort of stepped in and made other plans, but it was meant to be um, because that Wheel of Fortune looks like a clock. So... They could also be getting like messages and signs from the universe that you've come into their life at a special time. Um, like they could be celebrating the anniversary of a loved one. Um, they could be mourning the loss of someone. They could be really needing some light in their life because the hermit is guided by light. Um, especially applies to Gemini here. There's a Gemini connection. Although this is Virgo energy, the Virgo is ruled by the same planet as Gemini, uh, the Mercury, Mercury planet. So... This is maybe especially more so for the Geminis watching. This could definitely be your situation or what you could expect from this person. Um, but I feel with the Six of Cups, they're starting to fall in love. Um, and, you know, they're putting you up online. They're making, your, making their passcode your name. They're telling everyone about you. They're feeling really cared and loved. And everything seems to be lining up very nicely. And it appears to be going very naturally they feel like things are happening very naturally and they feel like you are the light that they needed. And yes, they might be comparing you to someone from their past. It's probably because they haven't had this before, whatever it is that you're doing to them. Um, you know, giving them love, giving them attention, giving them a a affection, having this crazy intimate life, whatever you're giving them, they haven't had it before. So they're like, whoa, I can't believe I've been missing out on this all this time. So what a rocking reading here, Air Signs. I will leave it at that. Drop a like if you've enjoyed it, subscribe to the channel, sign up for membership if you want to uh, access two extended versions for readings and, and member videos as well. Um, otherwise, I'm sure we'll catch up very soon. So lots of love and bye for now.